funny. Remember in our last class that you know we did, we actually you know, create some sort of uh, flowers, you know, uh, feeling like in you know, a springtime season. Then I actually you know, show you how you can actually combine the inner you know, crayons and watercolor together, so that it will actually you know, show you the uh, the wet and then dry technique. And obviously you now you can actually see the uh, the color in you know, a crayon reduced technique. Then okay, so this is the in you know, uh, the uh, crayon reduced you know, technique. Adding on a crayons and then adding some action you know, watercolor on top of it. Then. Okay, so uh, this is the background, like you know, springtime kind of a moody feeling that you know we created. Okay, then let's actually put it aside. And today, you know, we are going to actually create the actual bunny. Okay, so this is the you know, uh, the A4 size of a paper. Okay, white paper is fine. I want you to actually uh, divide it in half and then uh, uh, fold it in half. Then okay. In this case, then you, know, you can actually you know, create the bunny in symmetrical images. Okay, it's an easiest way you know you can work on it then. Okay, so once you have you know divided line, fold, fold it in. Okay, I want you to actually grab the pencil. Okay, a lot of times I ask you to actually you know what, uh, sketch line very light with a pencil, right? This time uh, you are going to draw very very in you know, uh, more layers and thickening your pencil line okay so I want to start with you know the one side of the sections okay so first I want to actually you know, draw uh, the head of you know of the bunny so let's do this one I want to actually start from the bottom down here okay let's say you know this is sort of a center right I want to actually start from in here then because you know, we need to actually you know, draw the big ears of the you know, bunny, right? So I want to actually start from somehow, uh, somewhere around here. Then, so let's say you know, uh, let's divide it in you know, uh, three times of, of the bottom. So one, two, three. So let's actually start doing this one. So I want to actually you know, draw here. little bit like the shape of you know ear take a look at the very detailed line drawing okay you need to follow it when you actually look at this one okay and then let's draw the big jack rabbit's ear okay then you're gonna draw the lines of this okay then you're gonna draw the the nose and then the mouth together so I'm gonna actually draw down here okay and then I'm gonna actually draw the uh, the ear I'm sorry the eyes okay so the eyes is gonna be uh, let's say around here then okay and making some a little bit eyelash if you want to and then darkens in inside Then I'm gonna actually you know, draw another, you know, one more lines coming down. Okay, so here, and then maybe a small line here, and that's gonna be. Okay. So I'm actually you know, creating only on one side, okay? Now remember, you know, the rabbits, we are going to actually you know, talk about the, you know, uh, the repetitive you know, uh, pattern, right? So uh, in order to actually create the repetitive pattern, you need to start with, with the lines, right? So I want to draw the you know, lines. Remember, this is the uh, contrast and a repetition. So I want to do a repetition then, okay? Okay, 
Then I'm going to draw another line. Two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Then I want to make a slightly curve line on a line. Okay. Then maybe some a little bit curve lines and eyes. Okay. Okay. And then I'm going to have one, two, three, maybe four bottom lines in here. Okay. So I'm actually you know, working on only a one section. Alright. Sorry, I shouldn't have actually done this one, but you know I did. Okay. So I did this one. But you know, we need to create the other one and make it a same. Alright? Yes, same image images that you know we created on the other side. So how do I do? Yes. Uh make sure that you have to fold it in and really press it very hard. So I think I just you know, use you know H B regular pencil, you know what I mean. But if you have a little bit you know darker leaves of you know pencil, then you pretty much actually you know see the all the you know, lines on the other side. But right now I can't see it then, right? So what you can do, you can go back 